My wife loves Pottery Barn, duh. So she asked me to dupe these pumpkins. Fine, no problem. But then she asked if I could dupe these spooky vases, and I was like, which please? I was bone to be wild. I painted each pumpkin with two coats of drylock. This will not only give the pumpkins a concrete or terracotta look and feel, but they'll be waterproof for outdoor use. To get the slightly weathered concrete look the shrimp wanted, I lightly sprayed the pumpkin with watered down black paint. I followed by spraying water over the black paint. I did this a few times until the monochromatic gray had a little dimension to it. Now, for this particular trio, I decided to go a little darker with the black, let it all dry, and then hit it with some watered down oatmeal. For the vases, I started with a pair I got from Goodwill. I got a beautiful hand from Dollar Tree and sliced the fingers so I could loosen his death grip. I then hot glued that hand onto the smaller vase. I got this triple skull stack from Dollar Tree, ripped it in half, and glued the stack onto the larger vase. Then I painted both with a few coats of bone white dry lock. Well, I think they turned out great, and the witch likes them even better than their inspiration. Now, about those pumpkins. I made two according to my babe's wishes, and the tall one trying to be faithful to the Pottery Barn inspiration. Which do you like better?